Hey guys, Jason here, and I'm bringing you a little first impressions on a game called The Long Dark. Now, currently, uh, we're just starting out fresh. I picked a fairly, um, like, I guess an easier setting, because this game can get very difficult. And I never really played it all that much. I only played it for a temporary short period of time. So, this is where we're starting out at. I don't know, I don't necessarily know how good this is of an area. I have no idea where I am. Uh, I forgot that I have a little bit. But, see, when you start off in pilgrim mode, you do get all this stuff to start off with, so... Um, oh my gosh, I forgot how fucking slow it is. It's so ridiculously slow. I mean, this is as fast as you go. You don't want to run because you get tired, like, super fucking fast, so, um, but we'll see, let's, let's see what we got going on here, okay, I just gotta get reacquainted with the, the controls, I think I kinda wanna follow the railroad tracks, and I don't know, no, I don't wanna leave the coastal highway, so, I don't know where that will go, um, man, I don't, I don't know where we are, I'll have to look at, like, a, at a map or something, and I don't know why this went off, because I turned my... My ringtone volume down is low as it will go, so sorry about that guys. I'm trying to fix that, I know that shit always goes off in my, my videos, but uh, it is what it is, sorry about that. I don't, oh my gosh, you fucking terrible like that. Jeez, I don't know if I want to go down there. I kind of do, but I kind of want to follow the railroad tracks because you feel it, you know what? Well, you follow the railroad tracks, that's you know, what railroad tracks. They're bound to hit like an intersection or a road at some point in time. So, or, I mean, you hit a car or whatever. Oh, oh! Holy oh, shit, we almost started uh, the game right away there. So, the whole key of this game, though, is to survive. There's no zombies or anything like that. So, let's see if we can see anything from this rock here. Um, it's always good to get a vantage point in this game because that way you can see, you know, in the distance. Oh. And there's something down there. I don't know, there could be like a logging camp down there or something like that. Alright, there we go. But I still think we're going to follow this, this here. And I actually see a little cabin over here. So we'll see what's in this little cabin over here. Oh, you know what, guys? all this talk and we might actually have to go down that way because I think this might be blocked off up there. So, let's go see what we got going over here. Yeah, it's blocked off over there. It's a cave-in, so let's see what's over here in this building and then we're going to work our way down. So, let's see. I don't know, what's this here? So we got a flat bar. Um, okay. Oops. Best be prepared for anything. I forgot what the, the pickup button one or pickup button is. It's actually a left mouse button. All right, so we got a, candy, a stale candy bar at that. You know, the mouse mouse sensitivity is up pretty pretty uh, high. So I'll show you in a second here. When you get gloves and shit like that, you find them around. Uh, the whole thing with that is you want to look and see if there's a uh, Oh my gosh. I'm so used to like tab for my controls. But okay, we found these gloves, so let's click on it. So we don't want that because if you see it, it puts everything down and, and we don't want to go down anymore. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna get cloth out of it. And you gotta look every time you do something like harvest that. Uh, here I'll show you something else. Let's see. Say I want to harvest that, it takes 20 minutes, and I'll yield one cloth, and then also, if it's like a major job, like a shelf or whatever, if you want to tear that down, what happens is it uh, mm, will take that. Will what handy. happens is it will, like, use up calories and shit, too. Let's see, I don't know if that's, like, a better class of gloves. No, we don't want that either. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to harvest that and get some cloth out of it. See, see how I'm using calories there? I use like 20 calories or some shit like that. So we don't got nothing good in here. We're going to leave the trailer. We're going to walk down the mountainside and, and see if we can't find somewhere. So 
And the thing with this is, we got about nine hours of daylight left. So within the next nine hours, um, well, actually before that, we're gonna get like tired and shit. So we're gonna want to find uh, a place to spend the night and rest up and shit like that. So I don't. There we go. You gotta be careful because one time I jumped like three foot and I died. So it's kind of like a Daisy type deal. You know, Daisy, how you jump three feet and break your fucking legs. Yeah, it was like one of them deals there. So. Um, Alright, let's see. Yeah, this is very desolate. Very out in the middle of nowhere. I still don't see... You know what, let's, let's work our way up to that. Oop, that little mountain thing down there. That way we can see if there's anything around. Actually, can we look up here? Oh, fuck it, let's go down this way. Alright. Ooh, what we got here? Alright. One time I got... Well, I only played this a couple times, but the one time I actually started off in a little, like, hut, and I, I there was everything was in there. There was a gun, and there was, like, every fucking thing. So, newspapers and shit like that, we could use that stuff for, for, um, for starting fires. Rag, I don't know. I don't think that's any good. Oh, no, see, that's actually better. So, we're gonna wear that. And we got rid of this, so... I think... 20 minutes. Yeah, we're going to get some cloth out of here. I only want a couple cloth because that way we'll have some cloth. And if we get an emergency out in the, the weather, because sometimes the weather gets extremely bad, and then um, we could actually make a, um, a little snow fort, a little snow hut, and then, uh, and then uh, sleep there for the night or sleep there until the weather goes away. So... Um, let's see, I don't know about that. I don't know if I really want to take that because then it's like a lot of, of weight we're adding on there. Because you got to watch out your weight, too. But let's get out of here. So, yeah, sometimes the weather actually gets so bad that, um, you, uh, that you can't see. It's like the visibility's down. And then we're up, up there in the left hand corner where it says eight hours of daylight. It will actually tell you, it question marks, it doesn't know. When the, when the next daylight will be. So, let's get up here on top of this little little mountain here and see if we can find anything. It says this area is rich in, um, what do you call it? Uh, shelters and stuff, so. Oh my gosh. It's like a fucking wasteland. Oh my gosh, look at that shit. That's a big fucking lake, though. Uh, I see some shelters and shit like that. And I think... I don't know if it's a rock over there on that mountain. See the mountain right in the middle there? It's either a, a rock or it's a... Uh, it's a cabin, so... Let's work our way over there and, and see what we can't find. So we're actually doing pretty good. We are getting a little tired. So, at the next place we stop, I'm actually going to rest for a little bit. Because you can rest. You know, you don't have to necessarily uh, go to sleep. You can just take a little rest. So. Let's see. What do we got going on over here? I just saw something there behind the trees. Oh, these little shacks out here. Oh shit, there's a fucking bear. Yeah, we don't wanna we don't wanna go near that bear. This isn't, this isn't seven days to die. That bear will fuck our day up. So we're gonna just stay away from that, that bitch. And there's a wolf, of course. So let's let's get away from both these guys. This wolf will fuck your day up too. Something something pretty pretty bad. I don't know, we, we actually gotta find a base of operations. Like an HQ headquarters. So let's see. 
we'll find something. My other game, my save game, the one I actually got somewhere in, I got to like a, a fucking dam. And, uh, and then the dam, the dam was pretty cool. It was pretty big though, so there was like really not much to do there. Yeah, I mean, I liked it and all, but I don't know. That's one thing about this game. Like, it, it's kind of, uh, I don't know, it's like, it's not really that exciting. You know what I mean? Like, this is the extent of the game. You know? I gotta watch some other people's walkthroughs and, and gameplay, because I don't, I don't know what they do necessarily for the whole game. And I tell you what, another game I wouldn't mind making some episodes about, that would be, uh... Uh, prison Architect. I, I do like that game quite a bit. It's it's pretty cool, and uh, I wouldn't mind making a little a little prison on a little prison on on uh, and on YouTube and, and see how it does. Is that a fucking house out there? I can't tell. I think it's a rock. I think it's a rock up there. I don't know. I have to get closer, I guess. That's a fucking, that's a house up there, I think. We're gonna check, is this checkable? No, it's not checkable. Alright, we're going to check this house. This little cabin, we're gonna rest. And then we're gonna go on the middle of the island. That's where we're gonna go. See if we can't find anything good. So, I see us land. We're taking that fucking land. Alright, come on. Shit, bullshit. What do we got here? Tin of sardines. Alright, summit. So you can never have too many liquids. And I actually think in real life that soda makes you like dehydrated, I think. I don't know for sure, but I'm pretty sure because I know during like the working day if you drink soda and uh, no water, like it's not really that good for you. And you piss yellow and stuff like that, so I'm assuming it's not not very hydrating. But yeah, let's let's make her. Oh, I didn't rest, and I'm getting tired. Fuck. You know what? We're gonna rest for a little bit. How much? We got seven hours of daylight. We're gonna rest for two hours, and then we're gonna run as fast as we can and try to get to that middle island. So, and hopefully, that yeah, will do it for three hours. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Alright. Rest. I, that was fucked up, man. I hit past time by accident, and that's not really that, that good, so. Alright, so we're like, we're getting there. So we're gonna make it to this middle island. Hopefully there's a bed there and a little shack and we could just we could use that as our base for a little bit. I don't oh my gosh, I don't know what just happened. And now I can't even see the middle island. You gotta be fucking shit dicking me. You gotta be fucking kidding me. I I remember looking at this this little fucking thing here and, and it was like right past that, so hopefully this right past this. That's fucking ridiculous, man. That's fucking crazy. Let's see. I don't know what we're gonna do. If we get lost, that's that's not gonna be good. I don't know. I don't really want to rest or yeah, rest anymore. All right. So let's just go straight this way. it or not guys oh no oh my god yeah I think I don't fucking know man it must be I don't think I'm running along the coast yeah this is it over here see how slow you go 
Oh my gosh, that's definitely a fucking shack up there. Let's hope we find something good up there. See what I mean? Like this is a little like like uh, time consuming and shit like that. Like it's it's a cool game, don't get me wrong, but Oh my god, I'm so fucking tired now. Dry mouth, I'm fucking hungry. And there's three hours of daylight, so we're gonna get up here and we'll just we'll rest here for the, the full night. We'll cook and uh, sleep and all that shit, so we might as well just drain ourselves out, fuck it. Oops. I don't know if you guys can see that. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, yep, here we go. Oh, this is pretty cool. So once it's daytime or tomorrow or whatever, we should be able to look out here and see what's beyond beyond this area, so I don't know why everything's all fucking green and shit. Oh, this is cool. This is going to be our fucking base. I like this a lot. This is going to be our base for now. We'll see what happens. So, let's go ahead and loot that, and then that's going to be the end of this episode. Ooh, we got some good socks. I think. Where was that? Yeah, we got some good socks. Where's this other shitty socks? Alright. We'll get rid of those. We can leave some of that stuff there. We got bandages, I believe. Uh, wait, let's go look around first. Let's see if there's like a gun. A place for a gun. Usually a... Let's see, hold on a minute. Yeah, there we go. Oh, this is fucking cool. Leave house. We got everything here. Everything you can fucking ask for, we got. So now I don't see a spot for a gun. Unfortunately, so that sucks. But what are you gonna do? Alright, there we go. Let's put our lantern down. Bench. I'll take it. Do we have an oven in here? Like something to start a fire? There's gotta be a fucking fireplace in here. You can't tell. There's no fucking fireplace in here. We got our lantern. That's crazy, yeah. Uh, uh, that is seriously fucking crazy. How can there be no fucking fireplace? Alright, whatever. Um. Alright, that's going to be it for this this episode, guys. Um, I appreciate you guys watching. I really do. I appreciate all the... Ooh, there we go. Appreciate all the good comments you guys leave me and all that. Um, just uh, stay tuned and, and keep on watching. And, uh, you know, Sunday, which by the time you're seeing this should be tomorrow, we're going to do the uh, drawing to see who wins that $20 gift, gift certificate. And then uh, the next gift certificate is going to be at 250 subs. And when I made this video, we were already at over 230. I think we are at 231 when I made this video. So um, thank you guys. Seriously, thank you guys so much. I appreciate everything. And stay tuned for the next, uh, next episode. Thanks.